Hell yeah, this is a good day. Yo, what's going on everybody? My name's Dusky. Right now we're heading out uh, heading out to Salt Creek to go shoot and go, gonna go shoot the AR. Just, it's been a while. I've only actually shot my new Daniel Defense AR one other time than this. And uh, yeah, I need to get some, I need to get some time behind it. So yeah, we're out here. So you see this boat out here? I just shot through it, just through the corner of it, with my AR, went through it like nothing. We're gonna, we're gonna shoot through the whole thing now and see if we can get it all the way through, fuck yeah. All right. There's the hole. Oh hell yeah. yeah. Went right yeah. through the other side like Nuck. nothing. Yo Glenn, it went right through the whole boat. One side to the other like nothing. Nuck. Uh, doing what I do, living my life not to impress you. Fucking destroyed it, hell yeah. Knew when I was hungry, I'd be chasing down the wealth. Uh, beautiful women are up on the brain. No sacrificing, there will be no gain. Numb in my face till I'm going. And Dude, shooting feels so good, especially shooting an old boat. I don't know why, but it feels amazing. I know, it's just chilling here. Like I'm gonna take the take the opportunity and shoot it up, just like you are right now. Glock it to death. Already shot. It was yeah, yeah, already shot. We gotta clarify that. Yeah, well, we didn't start this. Yo, bro, I want you to try this out. Oh, hell yeah. He's got to talk it, but you can shoot this whole mag. How much you put in is how much you get. Make it the first time shooting 10 millimeters. Holy shit, this thing's massive. I know, it's fucking big, fucker, isn't it? AR, whatever. Honestly, hold it. Okay. This wasn't good. I don't really like to pay attention to the nine does, of course, but with a plan, gonna get it with my fam, yeah. With my bros, tell me RIP, yeah. Might be the next rap G O D A. Look, call me cocky. It's like a fucking desert eagle. Blocks. I love it. Uh, isn't that isn't great. Hell yeah. This, call me dad. I don't really give a fuck. I don't really give a fuck, cuz I am who I am. Can't change. Okay. We're good. Dude, honestly, I've never even heard of the 10 millimeter until you were all about it. And honestly, it's just pretty fucking nice. I expected it to be more like, it hit like more recoil. More like, yeah, it, it was just I really smooth and nice. Kind of felt just like all the other Glocks shooting them, but just way more of a bang behind it. You could feel the power. Like the 45's got a lot of stopping power. Yeah. The 10 millimeter is so fucking fast that you can shoot. It's, it's kind of like the AR compared to the AK. It's so quick. Yeah, I agree with yeah. that. I agree with that. You're right. It, it really is quick as shit. At first, when you messaged me that, you're just like, it's fast. You're like, I know. I was just like, <laughs> all guns are fast, bro. Like, I totally was like, just going with it, but I totally did not get it. I was like, what do you mean? Are you guys both recording? Hell yeah. Fucking hey. That was tight, bro. Got me a little wet on my leg, but <laughs> we're good. Just gonna get right up in it like so. Just shot water right back at me. That was no good at all, bro. <laughs> it's dead, for sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yo, so there's like a massive forest fire, like only like 14 minutes away from my house right now. And I mean, dude, look, look at how smoky it is. Right now it's like 6 a.m. in the morning and look at how smoky it is up here. Look at this. You can barely even see the mountain right there. It's just complete solid smoke. Look at the mountain over there. It just literally disappears into the smoke. So this huge fire is right up the road, up this way. So it's like basically right over here, like this is where the fire is burning. This is my house, I'm staying right here. <sighs> Unless the fire gets closer, then I'm, then I'm gonna leave because I'm not just gonna burn. I'm gonna grab all the shit out of my house, I'm gonna throw it in my truck in like an emergency. I've already picked out in my mind what I'm grabbing if this goes down. All right, so check this out. This is a map showing the fire near my house. This right here is representing the fire and what is burning. The red is the level three evacuation zones, the yellow is the level two, and luckily, my house is right in this little area right here. And that's currently the date right now. 
All right, so we fast forward a day and the smoke is significantly worse. Look at this. Yesterday, there's a hill right there. You can't even see it anymore. Yesterday, you could see it. Now, it is just completely gone. Dude, see, every single day, the smoke is just getting worse and worse and worse, thicker and thicker and thicker. You know what that means, dude? The fire is getting closer, okay? That's not, that's, that's not a good thing. The hill, you can just kind of see it through the smoke now, but it's pretty much completely gone too. Holy shit, look at the sun. The sun's just completely red. It's not every day that a freaking wildfire is next to your house. Get him, buddy. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, he's pouncing, he's pouncing, he's pouncing. <laughs> Look at him go, dude. He's running all funny because his foot is hurt. All right, so check it out. We just got this. Uh, some dude stopped by and gave it to us. We're officially on level two for this uh, evacuation notice for this huge wildfire next to our house. Um, fucking shitty, bro. It keeps getting closer. Nothing we can do about it. We're officially level two now. Yeah, this was issued by the sheriff's office. So, yeah, this is legit. It's actually pretty wild being handed a evacuation notice. Like, being handed a piece of paper saying you need to leave your house because disaster's coming. You know? It's definitely not a good thing. So, basically, what level two means is I have to have everything that I want to take with me ready to go at a moment's notice in case... It bumps up to level three, which is leave immediately. All right, update on the whole forest fire situation. Last time I talked to you guys, the forest fire was six miles away from my house. It is currently four miles away from my house right now. I mean, it's getting pretty freaking close, bro. They currently have it stopped at a line and they're fighting it at that, at that point. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, those are just some pictures from the actual fire. As of right now, we're still on level two. It's been probably like three or four days since I recorded that last little bit of that. And uh, yeah, the fire hasn't gotten any closer. I guess they stopped it at where they were like fighting it, like the, the break or whatever. All right, for this next part of the video, I'm gonna be showing some footage from when we went up to uh, Summer Slaughter 9, which is Sniper's Den, it's an airsoft field. Um, just some footage from in the camp. And then I think there's like a little bit of airsoft footage in here. Honestly, we, I hardly even played at this airsoft event at all. It was so miserably hot. I was just you know, kind of hanging out in camp and having fun But the main times I really did play was at night So it was a night game So I didn't wasn't even really able to record but I did record a little bit of like the one game that I, that I did play So here here's like a little bit of footage Okay, so this is not 100% No, this is not 100% No, this is Just as much as you can 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 I'm sort of turned on. Take your pants off. Just until someone goes. Just a little bit of gonna choke. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's back up. Give him some space. He's right there, perfect. That's a wrap. That's a wrap, bro. It's been a long time. He time squeezed the tooth out of you. I'll go again. <laughs> he squeezed the fucking tooth out of him. I love you that. You want to go again? Round two. You're round two. Ass motherfucker. Set up. Take your teeth out. Set up. Okay. Don't let him get you. That leads to this. Okay. Come on, man. Spin out. Okay. Spin out. Shawnee, uh -oh. you're dirty. That's gonna Stop. be a wrap. That's gonna be a wrap. No, you weren't. Oh, yeah, you were. I was choking no. Trust me, you weren't. No. Oh, oh, dude, he is fucking kidding you. I was two seconds away from sinking that motherfucker. Don't let him lock you out like that. Shake your hands. That's a wrap, brother. You wanna call again? You guys are badasses. There's so much. This fucking dirt sucks. Come on, let's go. Yeah, buddy.
Oh, boom, boom. Oh, hey. Yo, you just turn right at the main door. Can we get up against that wall? Yeah, you can, but go, don't go past the halfway point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Come on. You got it! That's my boy, Red Beard! Dude, come on, I'm shooting the fuck out of him, bro. Come on, the battery just died. Good thing you gave me the backup. Got that guy going for the flag, though, right? Because I'm pretty sure we both shot him the fuck up, yeah. As always, my tent's a fucking mess, but yo. <laughs> Dylan's still asleep, so I decided I'd drop his tent on top of him. <laughs> Bro, everybody's packing up. What's up, Dill? <laughs> Morning, Dill. Yo, and a quick note for all the people out there that used to watch my gaming videos back when I used to upload them onto my main channel, this channel right here. Uh, yeah, I still make gaming videos. But yeah, if you're interested in checking those out, I upload them on my second channel called Dusky Gaming. So yeah, definitely go check that out if you're interested in that kind of thing, and yeah. This is what the channel looks like, Dusky Gaming. Alright, anyways, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, leave me a like, or a comment, or both. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day, or night, or whenever you're watching this. And like always, I'm Dusky, and later. Lately I am busy all the time. Love's a heartbreak, think I will be fine. Always on the strongest weed around. In the studio I will be found. I am busy being me. I am busy being me.